Hi guys! In this video I will show you how to draw with another drawing tools apart from the command line. If you go to the drawing section on the top, you can find there a lot of commands and there are some more if you click here. As this is a tutorial for beginners, I will only show you how to use some of them. Polylines, rectangles, circles and arcs. I think these are the most used and enough for beginners in AutoCAD. Now, I will show you how to use the command polyline. A polyline is basically a group of lines all connected to each other. Ok, so to draw a polyline, we can click in this button. Or we can also type with the keyboard polyline or simply PL and click enter. As you can see, this is the same process of drawing lines. I'm drawing as much lines as I need and when I finish I can click ESC or if I want to join with the first point of the polyline I can click CL that means close. So the main characteristic when I draw a polyline is that I select all these lines together because they are considered only one object. If I want to draw a rectangle, I can still use polyline, but if I click in a command rectangle, it is easier. That's because first I click to insert the start point, and then I only need to insert the coordinates of the opposite corner. For example, if I want a rectangle with 300 per 500, first I will type 300, then I press tab, and finally 500. So as you see for rectangles it's faster doing this way. Now I will show you how to draw a circle. You can click in this icon here or I can type circle or C. It's very simple. First I click to insert the center, for example here. And now I will insert the radius of the circle. For example 250 and click enter. So it's done. Now, if you go to the drawing panel and click in this arrow, you can choose the way how you want to insert the circle. For example, you can choose first the center and insert the diameter. You can draw a circle by inserting two or three points or also by putting tangents. So if you want, you can, you can play around with this because it's easy to learn. If I want to draw an arc, I can click on the icon above or I can simply type A with the keyboard. I click to insert the first point. Now I will put the second point and now the third point. At the beginning it may be a little bit difficult to draw an arc but with practice you'll get used to it. Also like the circle if you click in the arrow you can choose the points that you want to insert for drawing the arc. As you see, you have here several options. Ok, now that you know how to use these commands, you can play around with them and also discover the other drawing tools. So, it's all in this video. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you soon. Bye!